Tech Friends here and today is a very special day because we are going to be doing a stable diffusion in 3D. So basically you input a text prompt and it will give you a 3D model. It's the future now, I've waited all my life for this. And the first thing we're going to do is copy it to our hard drive or to our Google Drive and close the last one, change the name and start running this thing, let's see let's see if we are lucky and get this thing working okay we got a T4 let's uh, do the setup Told some dependencies. Yes, we finished the first step. Let's go to the next. Awesome. Let's uh, log in here. Amazing. Let's see. Let's try with a photo of a Tesla Cybertruck. Uh, let's do a car. Let's be more general because we don't know how how it might respond. Let's do a cellular photo of a car. And I think it's a good idea to put like this because we don't know if that picture is going to come centered or framed so this might help the thing let's let's do it Yeah, definitely this step is going to take a long time, so I'm going to pause again and come back in a minute. Okay, here we're back with the collab and it's uh, taking a bit of time to unwrap the UVs, but the array has the mesh apparently. It's saving the mesh to trial mesh, which I guess is a folder inside. Yeah, that folder here. We'll have to wait to see what happened there. We are setting the space trial, save the mesh. I thought it was saved already. Ah, okay, it came out there. Good, vertices now, texture, faces, awesome. But it says here, warning, failure to load optimizer. What that does mean. Finish it, saving the mesh, the step is done. Let's see, now it's gonna make a video also. And we can see our card, finally. Actually, I'm gonna open Blender. What? It looks like it just burned some uh, CPU time. Um, didn't do much. Let's see.
Wow, takes forever to download. Let's see. Mm. Save it first to the Google Drive, it will be a bit quicker, I think. I think it will be quicker if I save it to the Google Drive. Let's see. Pretty disappointing this uh, result. I hope it's not like this in the mesh. Okay guys, um, the, the result was exactly the same in Blender, it was just a, a cloud of uh, vertices and polygons. And I went back and I did all the steps with the prompt that they had and I have this result, which is a uh, crap crap. So basically we're safe, we're not going to lose our jobs just yet and it doesn't matter anyway because it was about like saving time and everything so I, uh, have, I have really high hopes for this uh, technology in a few months. This collab will be like a lot better I am sure. So in a few months we're probably going to have some working mesh out of it. I hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching and see me next time. Bye, thanks.